And there's a turnover. Oh, Chad Holmgren saves it. Feed to Timmy. Drew. Drew. Up and through. Well, oh, the Warriors, this is Reed. A quick three. Holmgren, the rebound. Here's Andrew Nemhard, number three. Up to nothing. Timmy, high, low. Chet Holmgren. Chet has hit better than 80% of his field goals. They try to get breakdowns defensively. And Reed short on that shot. Early in the game or early in a possession. I was at practice yesterday as Timmy gets the nice finish with deep post possession, but. Zags have hit three of their first six shots. Holmgren, another block. His 36th. 20 on the shot clock or so. And Coach Gallo called it a fake or a phony press. And Chet Holmgren. You my numbers? Give me the ball. Let's give Watkins some credit on that finish a moment ago. Did you see yeah, how high? Nice. Season's out. He's going to start burying the three-point shot. Okay. <laughs> and Holmgren another block. I mean, you think you're by him at the rim, and he just extends and comes up with a block shot. Oh, and Holmgren running the floor. Another offensive putback. It's really good, too. <laughs> There's Watkins. lots of those really good players. And another block by Holmgren, his third. I think if, if, if Holmgren can just get a little bit better defensively, couldn't catch it cleanly. Great feed, Holmgren. And Chet going back to the free throw line. Oh, when you're guarding up top, you have to influence or force one direction. He's obviously a right-handed driver. He started at the two the last couple of years. This year he's playing more of a point guard role for Merrimack. So it's not, I mean, sometimes you just don't play well. Night. Yeah. Holmgren, great catch. Can't Man, finish. I, I'd like Strother fights oh, through wow. the screen. That'd be got by Timmy, but missed the shot again. Timmy's slow to get up. Stomps on his foot. Holmgren lines up the three and connects. I'm sure he'll be No, fine. no, no. That dude's got a lot of hockey. <laughs> He'd be my centerman. That's what Drew Timmy would be. I'd put him right at center. The charts here, double figure scoring games uh, consecutively 33. That's a nice list of Oh, and it's Holmgren with another putback third of the night. Just yeah. I think it's about three free throws a game. Lost the handle. Great catch. Turnover number nine for GU. And Strother was there to make that shot too tough for Ziggy Reed. And Zaga with a head of steam. Oh my goodness. He's so fast. Trailing. Holmgren! Another three. Jet Holmgren with 13. He's only going to play one game this week with the cancellation on Sunday. As he earns another rebound. He's got 13 and 9 now at Mead. Great leave, shot missed by Watkins. And Holmgren. Anton Watson spins baseline, won't go. Holmgren another rebound, tried to flush it. It's poked away. He's put on four of 13 shooting. From the average of 18 of the last five is dancing the first half. That's a thick kid. Another block for Holmgren. Miner got it back and somehow <laughs> dropped it through. <laughs> and a chance for three. How did that even get up there? Here's the initial block from Holmgren. Do that far more than block shots in a game. They'll just alter. The fake missed the three. Watson pokes it back out to him. Chet now. Hickman's three. How do you fix that? A lot of veteran players on this floor. Here's Holmgren's three. I think a lot what do you of do with done in practice with drill work of at some point you're here for a reason you're good you can't make these mistakes Holmgren got his own miss back dumped it through unheard of and that is a two during the game yes. during the game that's a bit ridiculous and Salas moving well without the ball on the finish he's really attempt Nemhard finds Bolton in transition Holmgren crashes the board missed it and now Drew Timmy tying up Watkins at me. Oh, nice pass. Great pass. Holmgren. Tried to block it, but fouled. Chad Holmgren with his 14th rebound. Pass. Another turnover. Miner missing that. Holmgren tipped it to himself. 
Husky game canceled due to COVID within the Husky program. There's going to be a lot of film. There's going to be a lot of. That's going to be our final score, 80 to 55. Gonzaga with three players in double figures.